rail has been the means of long distance transportation from the last 150 years in India. As the railway network is well established by now, most often it's seen as a safe mode of transportation and not that of a conflict. But when it comes to wildlife, a particular region is most susceptible to rail accidents of large mammals such as elephants, tigers, leopards, deers and so on and so forth. Of these, elephants suffer maximum. One particular train from Siliguri Junction to Alipurduar Junction that spans 161 kilometers passes through forests, tea gardens and agricultural lands and poses a serious threat to elephants. Elephants have been using this corridor even before this railway line was laid. The genesis of elephant train collisions along this track goes back to the advent of British rule in the mid-19th century when the dense tropical rainforest of northern Bengal was exploited in the country. Tea plantations were introduced in Darjeeling and the plains of Duars between 1850s and 1862, felling prime natural forest and clearing wildlife habitat and changing the forest cover forever. The tropical forests gradually got fragmented with the interspersion of tea gardens, paddy fields, villages, roads and the railway line. Early records show that since 1974, there has been at least one elephant train collision per year and at least one elephant was killed in the accident. But in recent times, that is 2004 to 2015, the number of elephant train collisions has gone up threefold and elephant deaths have gone up by five times, which is an increase by 200%. The steep increase in collisions and deaths was due to the conversion of railway line from meter gauge constructed in 1910 to 11 to broad gauge constructed in 2002 to 2004. The broad gauge allows the trains to run at higher speeds and at greater frequencies. Although 65% of the trains run between 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. and the remaining 35% trains ply between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m., more accidents happen in the night. To add to the misery, adult males are 31% more prone to railway collisions, putting a heavy strain on the viable population as the adult males comprise only 13% of the entire elephant population in the region. A detailed study was carried out by Asian Nature Conservation Foundation ANCF all along the stretch of 161 kilometers from Siliguri Junction to Alipurduar Junction with the objective of mapping elephant crossings and movement paths along the railway line that passes through forests, tea gardens and agricultural lands. A susceptibility map was generated showing locations prone to accidents while elephants cross the railway track. 18 hotspots throughout the railway track have been identified where the probability of a railway collision is highest. A prominent reason for the accidents is because the elephants need to cross from one forest patch to the other, which is divided by the railway line. The accidents also occur as elephants raid the crops during May's harvesting season in May, June and during paddy harvesting season of October-November. At the same time, 
I think there is scope for a realignment, a partial realignment of this railway line. Uh, for instance, uh, from the station Madari Hut to Alipurdua Junction, the track runs through uh, the Jaltapara Wildlife Sanctuary and the Baksa Tiger Reserve. And I think it is possible to take the railway line out of the Baksa Tiger Reserve and uh, bring it to the uh, outer periphery or the boundary of the Baksa Tiger Reserve. And thereby, I think a large number of accidents can be avoided because the Baksa Tiger Reserve has again been a hot uh, spot of train collisions involving elephants. So I think we need to move towards an integrated, comprehensive and a sustained solution with a long-term perspective of ensuring that our railway connectivity with the northeast of the country is not affected. At the same time, we are able to bring down the accidents to elephants and other wildlife to the minimum extent possible. Recommended mitigation measures such as slowing down the speed of trains. Night driving should be curtailed on the Siliguri Junction Alipurduar Junction stretch. Installing early warning electronic systems. Building elevated tracks for trains or underground passages in hotspot areas and linking elephant corridors in non forested areas. Trains to run through New Jalpaiguri new Alipurduar stretch of the railway track as two to three additional railway tracks can be laid to reduce the elephant train collisions. With a concern the policy makers need to urgently evaluate protection of such corridors and a few permanent solutions.